Are you going to ask us questions? Or yeah, no, I'll say, all right, can you guys, why don't you tell us about your show, tell us your names and what your show's about? Uh, I'm Ryan Seslo, and uh, this is Energetic Fusion. I'm Jeffrey Allen Price. I'm the second half of this creation. I'm the part of the fusion. And, uh, you know, Ryan asked me if I wanted to do a show together in this space, and I said, of course. Like, I know, like Ryan has a lot of energy, and, <laughs> and Ryan has an all-over installation style. Our styles of art, I think, are very different, but our processes are very same. So we decided to, like, integrate our work together and then invite other people to come in. It's kind of an excuse for us to, like, have a place to work. It's also an excuse for us to, like, uh, work with our students side by side. Yeah, and this also looks... work side by side together. Sure. I've gotten to know Ryan better, and I'm, I'm a better man for it. It looks like, <laughs> no, it looks like, a, like the best art class I've ever been to. In terms of, like, there's students here, there's Excellent. work everywhere. How do you think the students are responding to it? Thanks. Very well. Yeah. You know, I've brought my classes in here a couple of times, and they feel looser. And uh, also, we've invited some of the other classes to come in and do their thing. And they're like, what can I, you know, what should I do? I can do anything? Like, they yeah. love that they can do anything. And, you know, we, I think part of what this is about is, like, breaking down the hierarchy of, like, professor-student thing. And also just, like, we don't have labels on these things, like, whose is whose and... It doesn't really matter. To uh -huh. us. Yeah, it's not the, the the intention is to 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 unify all of us together through the process. So all of uh, all of the energy should should transcend and and inspire each other, and from that point on, just allow for people to come in and just express themselves freely, and not have to feel they can't put their work next to one of their professors or you know this this other artist. That everybody's work comes together and. It bounces off of each other, and it plays off of each other, and it leads Jeffrey and I to creating new works based on just seeing that, and that's ultimately, you know, super important to this to our process. And so, why don't you give me a quick tour of the space and what's been going on over? And how long has it been going on now? Uh, two weeks. A month. At almost. this point, yeah. it, really? it's been, been a month now. So yeah. give, give me. Yeah, a... We're in, we're in the, in the we're, <laughs> we're in the latter phase of it. We have yeah. another one more lab on Friday. Yeah. Uh -huh. the, 27th yep. of April from 12 to 4, and then the 30th from 6 to 8, it was yep. our closing reception, Monday where we kind of like wrap it up and show the filled space and think about taking it all down yeah. and yeah. starting again. I'll help if you need it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. But no, show me, show me, show me around. So Point um, out anything you want to show me. Yeah, I mean, uh, well, I'm, I'm, I'm working on this here on the ground today. I mean, this is just a, a series of rubber stamps and a, a painted character that, you know, just allows for me to work really immediately and I love that about the, the process of art making and uh, um, over here we have you know some other paintings that are all collaged together from students. Jeffrey put this this logo up which is a, a photo we took of uh, the activation fusion of two two fists hitting together. Started this whole thing here. So. Uh -huh. How about you, Jeffrey? Can you show me anything uh, you want yeah, to show sure. me? Yes, yeah, so I brought in stuff from different periods of my work. This is brand new, actually. I just did this uh, earlier in the semester. And uh, this is used sponges. So you saw me earlier, I was working on like the used marker tower. Uh -huh. So a lot of my work is about accumulation and, uh, and, re and sort of upcycling or recycling things that most people throw away, like old sponges or old markers or something. Uh -huh. And then I have a juxtapose next to another series I did uh, about five years ago called the Gross Domestic Product Series, which were more like these kind of uh, gross or interesting or personal objects that I bought at the grocery store, and then I like painted them. Uh -huh. And then even this is from a, I did these last year in my, in my yard slash studio, uh -huh. uh, to just to show the wide range of stuff. This, I brought in an old thing from like 96, I've got a painting from 1996, cool. brand new stuff. How about uh, some, uh, let's show me some of your favorite stuff students have been doing. Is there anything? Uh, okay, well, well this, you saw it today, uh, look at Corey. This is one of my students, actually Corey is imported from Suffolk County Community College. It's good. Long Island's in the building. Yeah. <laughs> and this is his work that he did. Uh, oh, this right here? Yeah, so like, I mean, he, he filled up a, a big space and it's uh -huh. very colorful. And he's got a lot of processes going on here, so. You want to tell, would you say anything about it? Oh, um, yeah. And how did how did you find out how did you find out what do you think of the show the style of the show? Um, definitely digging the show. I like how everybody gets together and builds off each other's energy and style. Really mixes very well. I got into the show by Professor Price right here, who's one of my professors last semester out in Suffolk. 
and he invited me the other day when I was staring at our gallery. Uh huh. And I just wanted to come through, show some love to York. So, show, talk about what you made here. Um. What you? How'd you make it? A lot of this is done with a brayer, which is just a roller, and a lot of acrylic paint. I use some scotch tape for masking. Straight acrylic, right on. It's still a work in progress. Uh, I come from the streets. I'm into like a lot of street art, so more layers for me, the better. I might come back next Friday for the other half and finish it out, maybe a little bit of aerosol spray paint. But right now, it's just a really good background for me that gives me more time and more information on what I need to get out of my brain onto that piece of paper. So. All right. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right. Hey, if you want to show your stencils, though, the residue of the Oh, yeah. Are... Those are some of the stencils I, uh, I use and I donated because, you know, they're getting wrapped up. So these are from straight from Long Island. You might see them out there. You can see my face. <laughs> but, yeah. Thanks. Thank you. Good stuff. So uh, this is Jeffrey and Ryan. Thanks so much for talking about your show. Thanks for coming out. And uh, I'm going to be putting this up on the web and uh, putting it on the blog and along with some of the photos. So thanks a lot. Thanks for adding your uh, your tag. I hope that you yeah. add that in your video. Yeah. Cool. All right.